Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Maris, and for those of you who are first timers on this vlog, I create songs to help you familiarize the, the NPLEX topics. So today I'm going to discuss and share the lyrics of my Cardio Lab songs and the newly created Lab Volume song. So if I have a time, I will also share my Cardio Drug songs for you guys. One of the best tips I could give you is to start your studying or review with a prayer. Do not be afraid about anything but in every situation, by prayer and petition, with thanksgiving, present your requests to God and the peace of God which transcends all your understanding will guard your heart and mind in Christ Jesus. So how would you answer a question about a select all that apply question about an ECG finding of a patient with hyperkalemia? So are you, are you familiar with the ECG changes associated with hyperkalemia? Well, I feature that in my song. So please watch this video so that it will help you in familiarizing and even memorizing all those ECG changes about electrolytes and also the lab values that are very important in critical thinking questions. So this is my cardio lab song. Hey, an increase in drop I would be an MI. If BNP is increased, heart failure so it seems. But ECG detects electric activity. To the echo is just a heart ultrasound. If comes a time, the dimer is high, blood clotting is high. The coronary artery disease is checked through the cardiac catheterization. Blood lipid profile is also high. There together, hypokalemia T wave in ST depression. Hyperkalemia big T wave blood B wave. PR prolongation and QRS is widened. Hypomagnesemia. Torsad de If hypocalcemia prolonged ST and QT, then hypercalcemia. Short ST, wide and T, hypermagnesium ST, depth taller T waves, with a QTC that is also prolonged, hypermagnesium, prolonged PR, wide QRS. So that's all about my cardio lab songs. So if you memorize this song, then you can answer the still like all the apply question about that hyperkalemia ECG changes. Okay, let's proceed to my spaghetti song. One, two, three, go. Creatinine from 0.6 to 1.2, albumin 3.5 to 5.5 grams per liter. Uric is 3.5 to 7.5, ALT 7 to 56 units per liter. Bilirubin less than 0.1, troponin less than 0.5, BNP and LDL are lesser than 100, triglyceride is lesser than 150, total cholesterol less than 200 mg per DL. We are now down to our last love value song to the tune of Mr. Suave Carlos. One, two, three, go. Ammonia 15 to 110. Glucose 70 to 110. HbA1c less 7 percent for good control. 1.010. To 1.030 specific gravity that's normal in urine. 
Okay, let's sing my cardio drug song. A whole new world first. Okay, one, two, three, go. Meiosis out of it. Respiratory depression. Pneumonia hypotension. Constipation dosia. The nitroglycerin is light and heat resistant. Avoid seal then appeal via severe hypertension. Coughing Asians, Anjo edema Africans, Teratogenic po, Tashumit priest, Renal problem, each low PP, Beta blockers, Bronchospasm, Bradycardia, Libido is decreased. Do not keep to acutely compensated heart failure. Arms are tan rena and cardiac fetus abnormal. Black box warning serum potassium is also increased. Pulchano blockers of body pimi Constipation, headache, and AV block. Notable flushing, edema, pairing, peril, low BP upon sudden rising. Look diuretics, ectocrinic furosemide, bumetanide, and thorosemide. Lowers electrolytes and blood pressure. Autotoxic platelet low dehydration. An aspirating asthma alkalosis. Silicilism platelet disaggregates. Intestinal bleeding. Ray syndrome nephrotoxic. Autotoxic risk for bleeding. Okay. So the last song is my favorite cardio drug song because it is to the tune of How Deep Is Your Love. So I tried to tell my colleagues about this song and I, in my mind I'm, I'm singing but the way I'm telling them I'm just like explaining like a typical nerd person. So for example, one of my colleagues asked me about a certain drug like digoxin and I told her that do you know what digoxin is a cardiac glycoside it increases the heart contractility but it slows the person's cardiac rate you know that the normal serum of level of digoxin is 0.5 to 2 and the early signs of toxicity are nausea and vomiting for the late signs of digoxin toxicity they are blurred vision and AV block. So my the reaction of my colleague was what how did you how did you know all of that? So it's by singing it on my mind. So let's um, start or let's try my favorite cardio drug song to the tune of How Deep Is Your Love. One, two, three, go. The goxin is cardiac glycoside, increases the heart contractility. However, it slows a person's cardiac rate. Normal serum level 0.5 to 2. No say you're vomiting, early toxicity, blurred vision, AV block, early toxicity, hypocapotachase toxicity, the antiplatelets, clopidogrel, prasugrel, aspirin ticagrelor, do not give it ginkgo biloba and omeprazole. Ginkgo increases bleeding. OMAP counteracts action. Heparin check APTT. Therapeutic 46 to 70 seconds. Antidote is protamin sulfate. Monitor any hemorrhage. 
more far rin ko manin Check the INR to do three seconds therapeutic effect Antidote is vitamin K The thrombolytics out the place Streptokinase Dissolve the blood clots Give it in three hours to 4.5 hours Never give to Patients with active bleeding, hypertension, and on my YouTube channel for you to be able to learn more about um, my songs to help you familiarize and even memorize these kinds of topics. I hope that this vlog has helped you a lot for your NCLEX or nursing exam preparation. Please subscribe on my YouTube channel. So if you reach the end of this video, I'm going to give you a copy of the compiled electrolyte notes that I created in a Microsoft Word format. So please comment down your um, Gmail addresses so that I could send this to you guys. Thank you so much for watching my vlog.